I'm just going to add something to what I said a minute ago. Um, and that is, a lot of, t I feel you, to attack problems, you have to look at everything. You have to connect the dots between a lot of things, and which is what I try to do in my blogs and blog posts mainly, which have accumulated for 20 some years. Um, most people tackle one problem at a time as if tackling that would solve everything. Net neutrality was a good example of that a few years ago. Just ta tackling net neutrality won't tackle all the other free speech problems that we have, for example. So I tackle them all. But when a lot of people do, when enough people do try to do things that what I do, and, and it doesn't pay for itself, if they do it because simply they have the resources accumulated from something else, that can disrupt seriously the way nonprofits work and their ability to get social change in a normal way. So there's a real issue that the way I work could, if, if it's scaled, even though I don't have real impressive numbers, I still have a, some influence um, on what policy turns out to be because of the way I do it and the people I know. Um, if too many people like me work this way, then you wouldn't be able to solve problems like, for example, the police profiling of black people or of non-white people, for example, is easily, or it might interfere with solving these very specific problems. So I think that's something to bear in mind.